Hi guys, Lee Anderson gets more and more pathetic or just more and more desperate, I'm not sure which it is. So he posted a video to social media, which seems to be a bit of a hobby of his, where he wandered about in a back alley and pointed out TVs, doors and other items that had been discarded by members of the public. Now he blamed the local government here for not doing enough to clean up the mess. He even pretended to look for a district councillor behind a mattress. There are a few problems with this, but you probably already know what they are. On. Hey, oh, it's Lee, Member of Parliament for Ashfield and Eastwood. Here, back on Mokey Alley. Look at the state of this here. The good news is we've got a sale on on Mokey Alley today. If you want a fridge, if you're desperate for a fridge, there's one here, fridge freezer. I don't know what's in it. We've got gas bottles, another fridge freezer. We've got a telly there. I think that's widescreen as well. So come on down if you want this. Come this way, Karen. What's down here? You're back. You're breathing. I don't saw my last video on Mokey Alley. You've got mattresses. And um, the back. I mean, they weren't they were taken away, they're actually back. So what we're going to do is, we've got one, two, I think three dirty mattresses. What we're going to do is look behind the mattress again. See if we can find a district councillor. I know the district councillor lives over there on Chatsworth Street, just there, just a few hundred yards away. But here, let's have a look. No, no district councillor again. This is, come here, come here, Karen. Look here, we've got doors, we've got filth. We've got rubbish. There's no, there's no wonder there's rats running up and down here all the time. So I'm calling on Ashfield District Council again to get those bone idle councillors out of the office and get down here and clear this up for the residents of Ashfield. <laughs> I love the editing. Just let it run for another few minutes. Okay. Um, I don't know if Karen is a member of Lee Anderson's staff or it's a member of his family. If it's a member of staff, is this a good use of MP's resources doing these sort of weird videos? Um, now, Anderson uh, posted this on social media on, on Twitter. Uh, somebody asked a question or made a comment and they said, Ash here said, maybe an MP should do something about it. And Anderson himself responded by saying, I have already cleared this site with two lorry loads. Time for 35 councillors to do a shift. Um, but, you know, I don't believe him because Lee Anderson posts everything on social media. So why didn't he post a video of him helping the bin men or bin women load uh, the truck, load the lorries that he's talking about? You know, he couldn't turn up to take a photo of it or make a small video saying, look at me, cleaning it up. You know, the, the, the councillors won't do it, I'll do it. Now, these point these videos are all really pointless because the problem also stems from central government. This is Lee Anderson's voting record. And you can see here, uh, when it comes to local government or councils, it says here, has never voted on reducing central government funding of local government. But, well, that sounds good. But then if you actually look at the detail, he was absent for those votes. If councils don't have enough money, then they can't go around cleaning up stuff. And in many cases, if they don't have enough money, they actually have to start charging people to take away rubbish, take away mattresses, take away TV, stuff like that. And if people have to pay for it, or businesses have to pay, then what they're going to do is they're going to find other ways like dumping it on the side of the street. So if, cent if central government don't provide sufficient funding to uh, councils, to local government, then local government either have to raise taxes or raise prices or raise funding another way. And if people have, if people have a, a free option, they'll normally take that. If they have an option where they have to pay when it comes to disposing of you know, electronic items, mattresses, stuff like that, some people, unfortunately, will find a, a back alley and dump it there. When it comes to uh, voting against um, more powers for local councils, um, well, he voted against more powers for local councils. He voted twice against and won, won he was absent. You know, he, he keeps complaining about um, the councillor has been absent. Well, he's been absent pretty much, pretty often when it comes to votes in Parliament. So I think he really should shut up here. But once again, this is about councils not having enough money, enough resources. And if they don't, then they're not able to do what Lee Anderson is demanding of them. And you need central government providing councils with either the powers to raise taxes or raise res uh, to raise finance, or you actually have to provide them with the money yourself. 
Let me know in the comment section, guys, what you think. As always, your comments are greatly appreciated. Thanks a lot.